Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Natalie. Um, I'm just going to do a quick little crafty share with everybody. Um, for my work, I was asked to make some floral arrangements for the tables for Thanksgiving for this year. So I made seven different ones. So I'm just going to show everybody what I did. And uh, I figured the best way to do it is just to show each one individually. And so I'll just switch them out as we're going along. Um, most of the flowers are from either Dollarama or Dollar Tree. Uh, and I uh, got the baskets actually from Valley Village of all places. Um, not sure what else to say about it other than I... Uh, it took me two days to do seven of them, and it only took me two days because um, I actually had my boyfriend outside spray painting the orange ones, which I'll show next um, for me so that I could get the show on the road. Anyways, this one, this is one of those, it's like a, I don't even know how to describe it, it's just like a, Hmm, what's the word I'm looking for? I can't think of it. Anyways, yeah, cloth material type basket rather than a wicker basket. All the other ones are actually wicker baskets, but um, yeah, anyways, I thought it looked kind of cute in this little square one. So that's number one. And this is one of the ones that took me a little longer to make since, um, and actually the paint is actually still tacky. Um, my fingers keep getting stuck to it, but this was the, the, sec the this is the second one I'm going to show you. Um, the reason I had to paint the baskets was because they were, um, actually like an Easter basket. So I just spray painted them. I did them in this orange color for fall. Um, this is just that Rust-Oleum. I got it at Walmart. Just a Rust-Oleum paint. So anyways, um, this is the second one that I'm going to show you. This is the third one here. This one I used um, the big sunflower from uh, Dollarama in this one. I put that actually in first and then I just built the rest of the bouquet around it. These are those, I don't know if you can see them. These are those um, little picks that I got from Walmart. Actually, I threw those in too. And uh, I only had five little pieces like this left. Out of all the flowers that I bought, I only had like these five little pieces left. And I don't know, I might tuck them in depending on how tired I am. I have to attach them to... Uh, toothpicks before I can put them in. Just one second, I'll get the other one. So this is the fourth one. This is a square basket, wicker basket. I really like this one actually. This is the biggest one out of them all. And uh, yeah, this one turned out really good. thought they were so pretty. So I just hot glued some uh, of the dry foam in the, in the bottom. I'll just switch out to the next one. 
dry foam in the bottom and then I put some Excelsior on top of it just in case you can happen to see inside the the basket and then I glued hot glued um, those little these little leaves from the Dollar Tree or, or Dollarama either I think they both sell them um, and so I just glued them around on the inside of the basket just so that you can't see into the basket I think it makes just makes it look a little prettier and then I just after I had all the Excelsior in I just uh, started poking flowers in willy-nilly but I think they look very pretty Just something to add a little cheer for the old folks. I'm sure sh the, they will like them for their centerpieces for Thanksgiving. So only two more left. That's it. So this is just a little round basket. Um, I think this actually was a Christmas basket. It kind of looks... Christmassy to me, but maybe not. But yeah, I really like them. I think they all turned out pretty nice. So I had a few flowers left over from before I started this project, and now I have absolutely nothing left in my collection at all. I don't have a fall flower. That's a lie. I have one flocking ball left, which I put up here. This is it. That's all I have left out of all those flowers I bought. That's all I got for myself. So the rest of it all went into here. Well, all of these. But I think they look very, very pretty. And I think the residents are going to really like them and enjoy them. So yeah, that's my little share for this evening. Um, I have to take them with me to work tomorrow, so I just wanted to let everybody see what I did. Um, someone had actually asked if they could see my dog, so I think I'm going to show her. She, um, I'm going to have to move the camera though, so please excuse my movement. But she's actually just right here. Say hi, Buffy. How are you? Hi. How's my girl? Are you happy? Are you happy, girl? Oh, hi. Oh, my goodness. Sorry, everybody. Okay, thanks.